What's up, Africans? What's up, Africans? It's KLX and Omo. We are at 90s Knowledge Cafe out Detroit. Getting all this high energy, high vibes, and love. Uh, building with New Era Detroit and all that out in the mud. But I know the queen has some words for y'all. Okay. Um, so, um, we starting an organization and we calling all warriors of Africa. Um, it's called the United Warriors of Africa and basically this is a place for all, all Africans because we are all warriors of Africa and it gives everybody a space for the revolution because a lot of times people be thinking that the revolution is only about your frontline warriors like NED. NED is the frontline warriors but we need artists, we need engineers, we need financial advisors, we need, um, you know, Teach. scholars, teachers. We need everything within the community to be a part of this revolution. It can't just be one organization to save an entire community. So what UWA does is it plugs everybody into what they already doing based on their they talents and skills. They use it for the purpose of revolution, and we trying to monetize off of it. So now we building a nation within a nation. You don't have to go to the white man to get your money no more. You just come to your community. You an artist. You don't want to go to school. You want to be a rapper within your community, 17, 18-year-old boy. Well, you can do that. Come as, a warrior. come as a warrior for Africa. Come spit that African knowledge through your rhymes, and come get paid for it by your own community, by mixtapes or whatever it is that we do. So... I don't know if you got something to add to that, baby. Yeah, so one, one like, you know, with the Warrior, we want to understand that, like, since you mentioned, we both mentioned New Era Detroit, and on the front lines, not everybody feels so comfortable and, and confident to be on the front lines, but we all have to fight that war on the spiritual uh, battle, that spiritual um, battlefield, that war that's in our mind, right? The, the war is in the world that's unseen. And so, whether you identify as a, uh, you know, warrior knight, if, if these, if these uh, masks and things like that don't necessarily resonate with your spirit as far as you out there, you know, um, willing to uh, uh, take life, you know, if, that, if, if, if that's necessary, uh, you need to take back your own life, right, and, and uh, take back the possession of your own mind, right, because the war is on, and, and uh, there's a lot of blood-sucking energy drainers that's trying to steal our promise. So, uh, it, so again, that warrior, you gotta, you gotta win the battle on the inside before we could even see any results on the outside. So, yeah, United Warriors of Africa is one of the different initiatives that we're gonna be using in 2016 and beyond to organize uh, Black people uh, around a central idea to strengthen the race. Yeah, exactly. And this is gonna be United Warriors of Africa is all around the world because we all warriors united from Africa around the world. So this is how you get the entire black population around the world to join a movement. Because we all suffering around the world right now because of white supremacy or what they claim to be white supremacy. So let's all bound together and let's all help our brothers and sisters through our United Nation. Yeah, so shout out to Radio Radio. And um, what's up, African? We out here. Black and Unleashed. If y'all want to uh, learn more about what's going on, just stay tuned with the movement. Y'all going to definitely hear about it. Peace. Black Power.